my travels, I heard of a great battle in your homeland. At a place called the Gates of Fire. The Hard Gates. You were there? No. Is that regret in your voice? I did regret not dying there for many years. But no longer. Habit, I suppose. I don't sleep anymore. Oh, it's far more confounding that I'm the tired one. I seem to stay awake for days at a time without so much as a drooping eyelid. Not even a nap. Gods do not nap. Oh, tell that to Thor. I scouted ahead. The lake's crawling with raiders. Be careful. This will be of use. Whatever you need. I'll heat up the forge. Want something in particular?
Whatever you need, I'll create. Cool. Their deaths will be painless. Ish. What can I make for you? Try not to break it. This is the place. <laughs> we need to work our way up. This way. Way through the ice? Oh, are the norms making magical ice walls now? No. I think the water just froze. <laughs> <laughs> Norns did to trick all these raiders into guarding them. Not that they have any idea that's what they're doing. your focus the sooner we find your son the sooner you'll be able to focus i just hope it works just the same thank you a fine sentiment but write on a bloody note when we're out of the cold brother something. It's stronger this time. Over here.
We found it. Ah, isn't it always the third place? Oh. Oh. Is everyone hearing that creepy whisper? It is like an itch in the mind. It means we've stepped into their domain. Be ready for anything. Illusions. Projections, possibly. But assume nothing. There's no telling what manner of creature they've made on the car. Delightful. our own minds yet he certainly seems real enough i hate to tell you the parts in your mind will be real too that way outside. Like a confused memory. A rather hostile memory at that. These fates should know I will not be deterred.
master of magics. Of the Valkyries. Witch of the Woods. Friend of Asgard. Destroyer of all she would hope to protect. She always finds somebody to blame. Mamir of the Aces. Here we go. Counselor to Kings. Mary Wander of the Woods. Robin of the Goodfellas. Let me guess. I'm a long-winded know-it-all and I cannot change. See? You forgot, smartest man alive. <laughs> Well, certainly clinks like genuine hack silver. I suppose there's one small consolation to this ordeal. At least we won't have to introduce ourselves. Don't credit your reputation, Mamir. They see the whole lives of any who approach them. Another gift of Fimblewinter, I suppose. 
The magic draining out of all of us has to end up somewhere. This way. The Norns are somewhere in that cave just ahead. She sound again. Normally, I don't mind ladies whispering in my ear, but this is positively awesome. Anyone ever tell you that you babble when you're terrified? Terrified? I'll have you know I'm at the very most deeply apprehensive. And breaking tension with humor is the sacred duty of a traveling companion. Hey, how very dare you? Babbling. to me, please. Stop! Why did you bring him here? You are not welcome here! Wait! Baldur, come back! Talk to me! I am so sick of your constant menace! to me! What you did to me! Try to stop him any way I could. Just lie to me! You served Odin from the day you met him to the day he put you in that tree! You sought the vapor. You wanted him to You watched him mistreat everyone and everything! And you never gave a day until you turned on! I know, Sigrun. It's true. All of it. But for love of you, I became a better man, a counselor for peace, an ally to all those who were you an ally to Freya in her suffering, to Scotty, to Grog, or to Tanya? No! You all took the side of the powerful men who used Brother, them. watch out! There's more of them! Even now, you see a violent god in need, and you can't help but hate him and call him brother! It's who you call him! It's 
not her. No. Of course. You did what you must. Brother, the thief! It's pulling me in! Mamir! Brother, help me! Monster! Atreus! I am coming! Why didn't you trust your own son? Don't let him take me! Atreus! I'm scared! Why wouldn't you see him the way he wants to be seen? I don't want him for that! Keep him alive! He's a murderer! That's all I have to do. And now he's mine. He's killed his own family! Atreus! I am here! He's a dead dog! I'm not safe with him! the test didn't feel much like succeeding i see the door has disappeared or it was never there they toy with us still what is that a kelpie don't see many of those in these parts she must be theirs will she take us to them i'll ask her nicely easy girl easy that's right <laughs> Care to talk about whatever the norms put you through? No. Get on. That's a good lass. Lovely creatures, but temperamental by reputation. In my land, they'd keep children away from the lost by telling them a Kelpie would drown them. Of course, no Kelpie I know would do such a thing. Unless it was disrespected. It walks on water. Aye. No mystical water steeds to speak of in Greece, brother? Mm. There were the hippocamps. They served the sea god. I battled one upon a titan. That might not be her favorite subject. Its own hideaway. Never doubted we'd make it. Kratos, Freya, and Mimir's head. Enter the home of the Norns. Tentatively. They have finally reached their destination. Kratos speaks first. I, I seek, seek my, my son! son. <laughs> you know the child is an Asgard. No, you seek what all who search for us seek. To know the ending to your story. The ghost of Sparta furrows his brow menacingly. He resists the urge to grunt. Oh, he fails. You come to us piteous archetypes, seeking freedom from your scripts. As if knowing your lines would grant you the power to rewrite them. Speak plain. <laughs> you will die, Kratos of Sparta. Are you 
but you called him the destroyer of fate. There must be a way to subvert destiny. There is no destiny, Park. The protagonists are speechless. They do not understand. There is no grand design, no script. Only the choices you make. That your choices are so predictable. Merely make us seem prescient. When my son was born, born shut up! up. <laughs> your prophecy said he would die a needless death. And he did. Because you could not let him go. Because he thirsted for revenge. And because you kill gods. But what Kratos did... It was not out of hate. Should I bring him a crown then? He still slays gods, but now he's sad about it? You are the sum of your choices, nothing more. And because your choices never change, you will learn that Heimdall intends to kill your son in Asgard. And you will do what you do best. And then Ragnarok. The skies burn, the curtains fall. Exunt omni. Heimdall. <laughs> Again, he misses the point. Focusing on the second act to the exclusion of the final. A common mistake in storycraft. We are, we are leaving. leaving. He stomps away, followed closely by Freya. I enjoyed your story, Kratos. Pity it has to end so soon. <laughs> <laughs> Well, that was educational. Mm -hmm.